Hi, I'm Jan. Welcome to Jan from New York City Saves Money's channel. I love helping people to keep some more of their own hard earned money. Could that be you? Listen, I have, I have to wear my teacher's glasses because I read something earlier today that made me think twice about something in general for anyone this can apply to, especially for those that decide to purchase a car straight from the dealership, brand new. I know, I know many people viewing this kind of a channel are probably people that do not do that, but there might be a person who just stumbles upon this video that normally that's how they do it. They purchase a brand new car from the dealership. So I thought that this was important, especially when it comes to auto repairs and tires. And so therefore I'm going to make sure I don't miss the beat with this tip for those that purchase a brand new car from a dealership. And in general, a wise idea is not to do that in the first place, but that's its own video. But if you did or doing it or whatever, be aware of service contracts and extended warranties offered by the dealer. Why? Well, most of them have limited coverage, despite what that salesperson may try to mention or to you know convince one. Sometimes it's a much better idea for you to find actually a repair shop on your own that you will probably always use and always go to instead of buying a service contract in a, with an extended or extended warranty. You really need to read the fine print and that's for anything where your signature is required. Read the fine print because a salesperson might have you convinced to buy, to purchase that warranty, including the regular maintenance, but only at a specific place with limited coverage. Like the way the salesperson may come across to you is one might think that it's all over the place and painting with a, a much broader paintbrush about the coverage. But the truth be told sometimes that only sometimes at a specific place with limited coverage. Let's say if you live two hours away from your dealership, for example, or the place where the coverage uh, can be taken care of, it may be very far away. And then you're stuck with a monthly fee. And that monthly fee is not going to go away. And it's not going to go away for a really long time. It could like continue on for a number of years, for example. It just sounds so expensive. So therefore, um, you're better off, for example, doing this independently, you know, on your own and finding that place where you would go to regularly. And sometimes people will find out, and it might be too late, that the fee could not or cannot be canceled and will be actually stuck paying that extra fee for years. Years. Oh, no. Years. It's just, it's just too much even from the get-go. My suggestion before you even do any of this, go around to the many, many channels that give such great specific things to avoid all of this and consider purchasing not brand new. Some people, they just like stuck with high bills and they really don't have to be. But that's another channel or two or three. Just the thought. This was supposed to be a shorter no frills video, but that's okay. Three minutes and 40 something seconds will do. Have an amazing, fantastic day, everybody. Don't forget to come back to my regular audio show, Monday through Friday, The Instant Coffee with Jan Show. I appreciate it. I upload Monday through Friday at 5 a.m. Eastern. See you there. Have a great day.